Fortnite is a game we play. Oh my god, you didn't wait for me? You're fucking mad, I hope that you can see. Did that egg just try to talk? I guess we need a hatchet, so we better walk. Brooklyn Hill is over there. Time to go into another totem's lair. That means it's time to start the episode. How's it going, everybody? This is Golden Bolt, and I hope you enjoyed our traditional episode 16 song. And yeah, welcome back to more Pokemon Sun. In the last episode, we met Gladion, the emo hot topic extraordinaire down on this route, and we made our way over here, about to go into Brooklyn Hill. Now, I said I'd off-screen in the, uh, I'd off-screen train for this episode, but ain't nobody got time for that. I actually didn't have time for that. I've been writing a paper for, like, the past three days. So I have not had time for that. Welcome to Brooklyn Hill. And up, oh, looks like it's a person of interest. Hello, I'm Lana, and I'm a huge troll. And when I say that, I'm serious. This girl is such a troll. I serve as the captain of Brooklyn Hill. You look like an able-bodied trainer. Can I ask you for help with something? Uh, sure? Then follow me this way, please. I love how they just have options in Pokemon Sun and Moon for like the same answer. Absolutely. Let's follow Lana and see what's up ahead. I hope it's something good. Uh, oh, is there an item down here? Oh, there is. You can get a net ball down here. Catches uh, water and bug Pokemon a little bit better. Oh, this guy's actually a I don't know if I've ever fought this guy before. This guy's actually a trainer. But yeah, if you haven't been able to tell, Brooklet Hill is very water-based. Or if you haven't been able to tell on Lana's appearance either. Uh, she- this is uh, all about water Pokemon, which is kind of a bad thing, because we don't have a lot of Pokemon that are good against water, or any moves that are, that tend to be really good against water. So, we really need to get something to even that out. H Hedge is actually gonna be totally useless to Barboach, as is Melee, because Barboach is, uh, water and ground, if I recall. So we would not be able to do that. We just really need- I need to teach Grass Knot to somebody or something like that. Yeah, you go ahead and try and Mud Bomb me. I'm gonna go and use Pluck. Because I'm awesome and I'm real! Yeah, I hope you enjoyed our little rendition of Starboy. Uh, God, man, that that whole album, the weekend's whole new album, Starboy, is absolutely just one of the one of the greatest jam albums I've heard in a long time. Like I can just put the whole album on in the car and just like cruise for hours and you know just keep listening to it. It's it's awesome because that doesn't happen all the time. Nice, wants to learn Thunder Wave. I will take that. Uh, we can go ahead and get rid of. Nasty, uh, yeah, Nasty Plot, I guess. Nasty Plot is really good. Oh, shoot, maybe I should have gotten rid of Sweet. I should have gotten rid of Sweet Kiss. Well, we'll go ahead and fix that when I get to the move relearner. God dang it, why did I... Which isn't until really late in the game. Oh, well, Nasty Plot would have been good, but... Uh, mistakes made in the quickness of creating Let's Play videos, I'll tell you that. And yes, no one can, no one really knows what to do when they're up against Ryo over here. Ryo just kind of sits there flying over everybody and just totally dominates it. This completely dominates it. Alright, well, we'll see you, Rio. We'll, or not Rio, Goldeen. Rio's killing it. Uh, nice, Fisherman Ernest. Not sure if I need to teach you any fishing tricks. Okay, Fisherman Ernest. You keep saying those beautiful things, I guess. And, uh, yeah, so last time I talked about that Bound Sweet that you can get. Um, it's actually a really wonderful Pokemon to have, uh, in this area because it is a Grass-type Pokemon. It's a really strong Grass-type Pokemon, too. Yeah, one of the strongest Grass-type Pokemon I have ever come across, really, in modern Pokemon games, which is something, man. I love- like, that isn't a starter, I guess I should say. Uh, what's up, Lana? How's it going? Do you like my shorts? Do you see that there? Ah, yes. The bubbling. Look at that vigorous splashing. I wouldn't be surprised to find a fearsome Pokemon as the one causing it all. So brave, trial-goer. I would like to ask you to investigate that splashing there and find out what exactly is causing it. Want to ask you to swim out there, of course. I have a lovely gift for you instead. Yes, yeah, she gives us a Lapras to our ride pager, so that is essentially, uh, Surf. Because you guessed it, having the, those TMs or those HMs and all that are just not things in the game anymore. Uh, it's just, it's weird that they're not, but they're, they just aren't, which is just really interesting. I think I want to fight that girl. I don't want to fight another gosh dang fisherman, because they just tend to have the same guys. What's up? But we can off-screen the fisherman, of course. I can Pokemon in my backpack, bounce around, and now I'm here. That sounds, excuse me, awful. Why am I always so burpy every time I have to record an episode? My body's always like, hey, GB, 
You ready to record an episode? How about you have to burp constantly nonstop? Why do you have a fletchling? I guess because you don't, you're not a fisherman. And they don't necessarily, well, whatever. Melee should still do well. Oh my god, of course I'm gonna do well. Oh my gosh, of course. You know what happened last time when I started off doing a Kardashian impression? You got whomped, like, like non- Yes! Paralysis, that's what I needed, man. I just needed to, are you using Fury Attack? Okay, it's just like must have been Peck or something. Nice, but now Melee is actually doing stuff and it's great. Oh my gosh, Melee actually killed something without dying first. She's gonna make it, guys. She's gonna make it all right. Well, it looks like I've been visited by defeat. Yep, visited by defeat. Defeat came and... Yeah, yeah, crap. I was about to make a terrible dad joke. But anyway, you can hit Y to summon Lapras, or you can just go up and hit the water, which is what, which is my uh, preference. I don't... No, that guy's a trainer. I was gonna say, that's not the guy we, that's not the guy we want to talk to. He's a trainer. We, we also want to... Uh, also want to go down here to the... Uh... Oh, we can see the fish spreading out hmm seems as though something strange is happening the vigorous splashing has gone down significantly what well, what just what are you hiding here the vigorous splashing is a wishy-washy very interesting i believe we can actually catch wishy-washy assuming that we don't beat it up with melee but who am i kidding that's not gonna happen um i'll be honest wishy-washy was a cons oh wishy-washy was a i don't know if that still is but Wishiwashi was a consideration for uh, our 16 member uh, for a while, and I still, still part of me still wants to use Wishiwashi. It's, it's one of those. It's a weird Pokemon, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, or you haven't played Pokemon Sun and Moon yet, which I honestly don't know if anybody's watching this who hasn't played Pokemon Sun and Moon, you're paralyzed and have like no health. Don't you brine me? You're gonna kill my Pichu. You know that, right, guys? I'm just going straight for the Ultra Ball, man. Forget this Wishiwashi. Um. But, uh, this Pokemon, from what I'm understanding from competitive, from a competitive fan, uh, standpoint, one of its, its transformation, which you will see shortly, um, happens to be Uber tier, whereas its basic form wishy-washy is, like, Garbo terrible tier, tier, but, like, it goes Uber or something, and he's just, oh, man, he's somebody, I think I was, like, Josh Jepsen or something was talking about it on Twitter, it was, like, wishy-washy was his favorite new Pokemon. I like Wishiwashi. It's not my favorite new one, but this thing is eight inches. What? Its eyes moisten and begin to shine. The shining light attracts its comrades, and they stay and they stand together against their enemies. Oh, it's pretty cute, man. Oh, it looks so sad. He's like, oh, he's so scared and all that. It looks like something out of like a Disney film. Wishiwashi, honestly. All right, well, we did it, Lana. I beat the little fish. So is Wishiwashi kicking up all those all that water? Even a little Wishiwashi can make such big waves. Splash, splash. I can hear the wild splashing from over there. It sounds even larger than we just saw. Is it a Pokemon? Is it a person? You are such a freaking troll, Lana. Such a troll. Can you hear that splashing from up ahead? I don't have ears, and I can. <laughs> wow, I'm so cool. I'm Rotom. I'm the coolest guy there ever was. We can get a nice revive over here. And knowing uh, knowing our pal... Did it just get darker? If it, I feel like it just got darker. But knowing our pal, pal Melee, she's going to need it. Look at that. Like She took like two, a br 39 health at level... Like, that is, that is like the low, that's like half of Bean's health. You gotta get on top of that. You gotta get on top of that. All right. Well, how did you get down here, Lana? I'm a troll. Oh, it looks like storms are brewing. Oh, that's why it got darker, because the storm came. Look, there it is. Uh, I'm sorry, what was your name? Of course, Tommy. It's a lovely name. Just lovely. Now look over there. Do you see that? Uh-huh. Whatever's kicking up such lovely splashes must be rather big. Strapping young swimmer, perhaps? Or an amazing Pokemon specimen? Do you think a swimmer would just... I, if there was a swimmer hanging out in that water, doing that, I'd be like, oh, he's drowning, dude. I'd be like, that swimmer is drowning. But approaching this, fish swim apart again, and we are faced with yet another, you guessed it, drumroll, please. Wishy-washy. Yes, yeah, just another wishy-washy. But it's good for um, some XP for melee. Because she, she honestly really needs it, man. Like, she is just... We just need we just need melee to not be a Pichu, honestly. But I don't know when that's gonna happen, and I really probably should have bought more. This is gonna hurt, isn't it? Oh, actually, did not do as much as I thought. And oh, Wishy Washy's calling for help! Watch out! What's he gonna bring? More Wishy Washy, which is just the best name because it's like, don't be Wishy Washy. Like you can say that to a person, and now you can just say that to a fish, an eight-inch fish, eight inches. That's not even a full ruler. That That is really tiny for... Well, is that tiny for a fish? 
I feel like when I've gone fishing, the most fish I catch are bigger than eight. I don't go like deep sea fishing. Nice, Whitaker going to 18. Um, I, I've never been deep sea fishing, mostly because deep sea terrifies me. But uh, it, I, I feel like even the fish that I used to catch as a kid um, on like a dock would be more than eight. It, one time I almost caught it, or wait, I think it was my brother that almost caught a turtle. I once, oh, uh, this like, this stands out in my, I probably, I probably was like four when this happened. But I once caught a fish and I hooked it through its eyeball. And it was like, I pulled it out of the water and the eye was like stretching like, like goo. I don't even know how to describe it. It was like seeing like silly putty stretch. But it was like a distance away, so it wasn't like right up in my face, which is good. It began to rain. Ah, how unfortunate. It wasn't a strapping young swimmer after all. Seems like you're really disappointed that it wasn't a strapping young swimmer that you could feast your eyes on. A whale lord in these lakes? Let's go investigate it. But yeah, that fish that I caught, I felt so bad for it because I was like, Oh my god, what's happening? And I went over to my grandfather and I was like, make it stop! And so he took it and he like unhooked it from the eye, man. My grandfather was a hero. That dude... I just called my grandfather that dude. No, he was... He was... He was like fearless when it came to that. He would... I'd always ask him to put the worms on my, uh... On my fishing hook and all that. Lana, Brooklyn Hill. Within it lies the legendary Pokemon said to be the embodiment of the sea itself. The mighty Kyogre. Uh, really? Oh dear, you won't be tr see what I mean? She just lies to you. She just straight up lies to you. Uh, could those splashes be caused by Pokemon whose moves are now growing ever stronger in the falling rain? Yes, probably, Lana, probably. We're going all the way into Brooklyn Hill. I don't know about this. I've got a bad feeling. Well, welcome to the trial site here at Brooklyn Hill. Totem's Den, or the Totem site, whatever. You come all this way with me. Oh yeah, trial start, here we go! That's right, did you notice you passed through the captain's gate by my side? Which means you will undergo my trial. See, what a troll, you must defeat the great totem Pokemon lo known as the Lord of the Ocean. Oh snap, that's brave, what do you see there? That is where you will probably find the totem. And perhaps those wishy-washy you, you battled against will also want their revenge. One is captured in my computer, so I don't know if he'll be helping. And remember that you cannot catch any Pokemon here unless you complete my trial, so let the trial begin. That's okay, I caught a wishy-washy earlier. Uh, as I say, I think there's an item down here. A hyper potion. Wow, this game's just like, listen, kid, you're gonna need it. Hyper potion is like, you're about to get your butt crushed. Which I'm not looking forward to in my butt crushed game. Anyway, it's like some Sonic music. Anyway, let's approach it. Thunder crashed over the open sea. Lapras is trembling. Yeah, the most terrifying totem of all time. It's Wishy Washy! Yes, Wishy Washy has an ability called Schooling that will summon other Wishy Washies to him and make this tank of a Pokemon. This thing is nuts, and I'm not even like making that up. We are gonna definitely lose melee in this fight. I'm not, I'm just gonna go for Thunder Wave immediately. This thing, well, it's really, that's what I mean. This thing is a tank, man. This thing is. Res it's just, it's a pure water type, but this thing is like legendary Pokemon status, but nice. We paralyzed it. That shouldn't count. When you're paralyzed, I feel like that counts. Like you should be like, oh, it's unable to summon it. But anyway, another Wishiwashi is going to show up. This is going to be a hard fight for us, guys. Like this is not going to be easy because of Pichu is our, like our only Pokemon that's strong against it. I don't know what I'd recommend at this point. It's always good to take out the other Wishiwashi, like the weaker ones. But if we can start attacking the other one... See, that's what a super effective hit does. Oh, I was gonna say, and did Big Wishiwashi just go for Aqua Wart Ring? But as long as we can withstand this fight for a little while, it gets... Oh! Why am I cursed? Oh, man. Okay, Rio. Go do... This is actually gonna be a hard fight for us. I, I actually have a lot of doubts with this fight. Should we Parafusion him? Let's do it. Parafusion Big Wishiwashi, Rio. Do it. Well, he's already paralyzed, and he can't cure that. So, few- oh, uh-oh. Oh, snap, he's getting buffed up. This is gonna be hard, dude. No! R Rio! Why did you mi- Oh, crap, he's what? Oh, jeez, man. He is wiping us out. All right, well, maybe the other one will go for helping hand again? Or do something? So I can at least confusion it. Rio's not gonna live through this, and we're gonna be screwed, man. Nice! Yes, thank you! 
All right, that's gonna be pretty helpful later on. This is about to get insane. I. Okay, well, Rio is out. Can you imagine if this were a Nuzlocke run? I would be toast. So let's hope that uh, Totem Wishy Washy starts hitting himself. Yeah, that's good. Uh, good strategy. Good strategy. All right, we'll go for Whitaker now uh, and just hope those fighting moves actually do something. I don't think they're going to, but we'll see what happens. I guess I'm going to take out the other Wishy Washy while he's here because hopefully. Well, I'm not going to be fast, is the other problem. God, I wish I was evolved as Whitaker. That's not going to. Okay, yeah, that needs to stop. We're going to run. We just need the. Okay. Come on, take him out, take him out, take him out! Yes! Good job, Whitaker. Oh, of course I'm gonna take him out. You mean I'm way, I'm way better than that. Hit yourself. Hit yourself, you giant fish! Oh, good. He's gonna, like, barely hit us at all, being parafused. Yeah, I used that. Oh, I should've used... You know what? Let's do it. Z-Power time! All-out pummeling! Whitaker, show him what's the, how, what you're made of, dude. Give him the one-two punch. See what it does this time. Oh, yeah. Boom, 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 boom! Oh, here we go. Time to shut that totem Pokemon down. Here it comes. Whitaker surrounded himself with a Z power. Come on, Whitaker! All right, all out pummeling. Let's friggin' do it. Here we go! Punch that fish, submarine! Okay, that did more than I expected, so that's good. I guess I. Why do you have a citrus? Is it a citrus berry? Uh, of course. Hit yourself in the face. Of course you don't. Oh, no! Oh, Whitaker. No, stop doing that! Please. They have failed. Fail, 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 fail! An Alamomola? If, as if we didn't have enough tanking problems as it was. Alright, this thing is not going to be faster than me, because it's Alamomola. And if it is, I will be very shocked. Do not be faster than me, Alamomola. Oh, it's fat. What? Do I have a read on Alamomola wrong? Come on, what? Dang! Maybe I have a read on Alamomola all wrong. This is not good. Can you ever hit yourself? This is not gonna go well. Beans is screwed. Uh, because Rain is weakening weakening fire as well. Oh my god, dude. Alright, who was our best? Whitaker did our did the best job. Oh no. Oh wait, wait, wait. Am I out of I'm saying am I out of revive? I got seven revives. I don't even know if that's enough. Uh we really need. I really need that wishy, the big wishy. Beans is just gonna die. Like, one hit. We are screwed. Oh, no. What? How? No, he's. Why did he have to snap out right there? No! What the heck is this game? Why is my luck so god dang awful? This is insane. My luck in this game is trash bag level of terrible. Oh my god, dude. I don't know what we're gonna do. We're gonna- I'm, I've never lost a totem fight before. I've never lost a- That better- does that hit everyone? Oh my god! What is this? This is gonna do nothing. Oh my god, at least it's paralyzed. I need to- Okay. Oh, man. Alright, we gotta do- I gotta do something here. I don't know what- we, maybe we need more supersonic for confusion or something? I don't really know. Please stop being a douchebag, Almamola. Live, 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 Whitaker. Thank you. Don't <laughs> I hate this. Why am I... All Every time I play a Pokemon game on camera, I get ruined by it. Like, constantly, dude. Like, consistently ruined by it. Okay, just go first, Rio. Just... Why is this Alamomola going so fast? I thought this thing was slow. Why is this thing so fast? I thought it was slow. Is this thing really fast or something? Thank you, Rio. Now, please hit you. He's not going to do it. He's going to kill Rio and then... Please hit yourself. Please hit yourself. Please hit yourself. Please, 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 please. Thank you. Thank you, good lord. All right. Uh, I guess we'll use a... I guess I'll take this time to... Take out, or at least attack Elmamola. This thing's gonna... Okay, so... So what... Wait, so this thing is fast and tanky? What? What is Elmamola's stats? What are they? Oh my gosh! This is insane, dude. This is absolutely insane. Oh! Oh my god, he unschooled! 
Oh! It didn't, I had to, I died and had to come back, but he unschooled! Oh! I don't know why he did, why he didn't do that the first time! We would have probably, this episode would have been like half an hour. Not even kidding, like it took, I actually like off screen trained and came back and all that. Get him, Rio, kick his butt! Come on! Pichu came out and died immediately. Kill him, he unschooled! Why didn't he do that before? He didn't unschool before, and then he somehow Momoa was just healing him! Whoa! He unschooled this time! Okay. I don't know why he did. But he did! Holy crap! That's amazing! And if I haven't gone through enough strife, my freaking capture software decides to crap out on me right now. Like it was it was like the instant I we beat the other wishy-washy. It was like, see it jump, and I was like, are you kidding me? So I, I was I had to stop in case I lost footage. Holy crap, I don't know why he decided to unschool that time, but we defeated Totem Wishiwashi. Why was that so dang hard? That was insane. Jeez. If he wouldn't have unschooled, I don't know what's gonna happen. I don't know what would happen. Lana, you suck. Your trial was hard. Very well, please come back this way. Don't tell me what to do. Oh. Oh, I must say that I find myself at an impasse here. All the wishy-washy that I so diligently trained up were defeated, and that is very frustrating. But of course I cannot let your completion of my trial go uncelebrated. You're amazing, truly impressive. Please take this! It's time to get another Z-Crystal, guys! Woo! Trial complete! We did it! Somehow, some luck seriously came our way right then. That was insane! Uh, you do know what this is, don't you? Watch, this is how you use Watarium Z. Yeah, you make little waves, I love it. And that's not all I can offer you here. This is the Lana original, one of my own handmade fishing rods. Yeah, so now we can go up to all those rocks that we've seen uh, while surfing. We can go ahead and fish in them. When you want to fish a Pokemon, look for piles of rocks in the water. Fish like to hide in the shadows there. When you see a bob uh, dip under the water, you have a bite, but don't. But you won't for long. Pokemon struggle to get away, yes, just like normal. Uh, she's gonna give us some dive balls also to get those Pokemon in the water that we fish out. Which is pretty awesome. What's up, Lana? By the way, did you know that I once reeled in a red Gyarados? Look at her! Trolling again! Did you really? Well, what do you think? Uh, I think you're lying to me all the time. You did a fine job today, so I'll see you back at the Pokemon Center on Route 5? Yeah, contemplating my life, I guess. Because that was insane. You're dang wishy-washy. You can always do a spot of fishing later. I'll do a spot of fishing when I dang well feel like it. Lana. Next is Kawaii... Kiawe's tri... Kiawe? Kiawe? Kiawe is probably right. Next is Kiawe's trial. It will take place at Wella Volcano Park. Oh, and that reminds me. Do you see any Sudowoodoo by Paniola Ranch? They were causing some trouble for people, so I gave them a little dose of Z-Power using my Waterium Z. Just a little lesson for them. Wonder how they react now if they see that you have Waterium Z, too. <laughs> what a freaking troll. Lana, your trial was hard. But anyway, guys, looks like we are headed off uh, back to Paniola Ranch to see those Sudowoodoo that we saw earlier. And, uh, holy crap, we're alive. Hopefully, uh, Pichu won't die so much all the freaking time. But anyway, guys, we're gonna end things off here. Thank you guys very much for joining me on this installment of our adventure. From me to you, have a very nice day, and I will see you guys next time.